give it to you, I'm defenseless Your kiss is a question Double take, does it taste like deception? Is my touch not enough? Cause we stay up all night, all night No more drugs, but the rush Leaves us like alright, alright Ain't got no time, no time Ain't got no time, no time, no so today I will be doing a review on this hair in my head today. This is a wig that I made out of bundles and a frontal that was sent to me from Belle Virgin Hair on AliExpress.com. I did sew the bundles of hair onto a wig cap to create this gorgeous thing that you see right now. I'm just so in love with this hairstyle. If you are interested in seeing how I did this retro 60s mod look, please look down below in the description box. I will have the link to this style tutorial posted there. Okay, so let's jump right into this review. So your hair comes in this plastic bag and you also get a package of individual eyelashes with your purchase. I ordered four bundles of 22 inches and one 20 inch frontal. The frontal was 13 by four. One thing that I really didn't like is that this company did not offer any brochure, any type of information about their company. When I opened up the package, I wasn't 100% sure where this hair came from. It didn't have Belle Virgin hair written anywhere on the bundles. It didn't have Belle Virgin hair written anywhere on the packaging. So I really didn't know where this hair came from. I had to, you know, go through my emails and figure it out. I did order four bundles of 22 inches, but it didn't tell me which origin the hair was from. It didn't tell me whether it was Malaysian straight, whether it was Peruvian straight, whether it was Eurasian straight. It didn't tell me any of that and I would like for this company to offer that or at least have some type of sticker on the actual bundles so that we know what we are getting. It is also helpful when companies do send some type of hair care guide for you to properly care for the hair that you were sent and that you paid for so I really hope that in the future this company does offer that as well. So the bundles smell really good. This is the packaging that the hair comes in. It just has a made in China stamp on the front. Again, there is no type of sticker on here that lets me know the origin of the hair, whether it's Malaysian, Peruvian, Brazilian, it has nothing on it at all. It doesn't even tell me the length of this hair at all. It's just a cheapy little plastic bag. This is the amount of hair that I have left. When I first got the bundles, I thought that this hair would be thin. But as you can see, this hair is pretty full for the density is pretty thick and I do like that a lot about this hair. So after I sewed the bundles onto a wig cap with my sewing machine, I did go ahead and bleach this hair to get this chestnut brown color. I think this is such a beautiful, beautiful color. I'm just completely in love with the color. However, I have one major, 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 major. <laughs> One major con about this hair that I've noticed, this hair has extreme split ends. Now, you do not notice the split ends on the bundles if you don't lighten it or bleach it or color it. I left the bleach on for 10 minutes and I only use a 20 volume developer. So there's no way that I over processed this hair and that cannot be why it had split ends. So to combat the split ends, I decided to use a silk press from Chi as well as another silken, silky something. And unfortunately the split ends were still showing, they were still apparent, um, but after wearing the wig, I don't notice them as much. But after I flat ironed the hair, you can see them. They were there. Um, you couldn't miss it. So I hope this company does get that together because you don't want to buy bundles of hair and the hair split the entire ends of the whole wig that you made has split ends. You would really just have to cut it. It's nothing that you can do about split ends, but cut them off. And yeah, that defeats the purpose of you getting a longer length. The two things that I do like about this hair is the fact that it's really, really full, very, very thick. I do love that fact about it. However, it would be nice to have really, really full, really, really thick hair that is healthy with no split ends. The second thing that I do really like about this hair is that as full as it is, it does not shed that much. I did not seal the wefts, but I am noticing very minimal shedding with this hair, which is a plus. 
I noticed that the frontal that they sent me did have a side part. It wasn't a free part frontal and I didn't ask for that so I am a little curious to know if that is their standard if they do send everyone frontals with side parts instead of a free part frontal. So I did notice that the frontal is a lot softer than the wefted hair. The frontal is a lot healthier looking than the wefted hair as well so I could have maybe just got a bad patch of hair. I'm not sure. Let me know your thoughts about this hair and let me know if you've ever tried Bell Virgin hair down below in the comment section. Have you had the problems that I've experienced? Let's start a conversation down below. And turn on your notifications to be notified of my next upload and hit that subscribe button if you have not already. I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye guys! Unless your love is mine